in 2017, the council approved the delivery of a new dual carriageway on the A421 from the M1 up to Milton Keynes. Now, some 30,000 vehicles a day use this route, so the dueling of this road will have a massive benefit for local residents, commuters and infrastructure for local businesses. The A421 is a gateway into Milton Keynes. It leads right into Magna Park, which is so important for our local economy, but it's also a gateway into those new housing developments at the south of the city. So as we see more development in the south of the city, what we're making sure is we get the infrastructure in first before the development takes place, and that will help to ease any traffic and congestion problems as these developments move forward. So this project is a really important partnership between Central Bedfordshire and Milton Keynes and SEMLAP and that working together to benefit all of our residents who live and work across those borders is so important. SEMLAP is the South East Midlands Local Enterprise Partnership so our role was to decide where to allocate those funds to and we prioritised this project as being key to supporting economic growth. Locally, it's going to lead to over 2,000 jobs and over 2,000 homes, so clearly that has a real importance here. But beyond that, it's part of the Oxford-Cambridge arc and it's allowing better connectivity between those cities and all the places in between, so it has a real power to make the difference. This project has been a great example of partnership working. The cost of the project was up to £30 million. Pounds. Of that, majority of the funding was provided by Department for Transport. The remaining funding, £6 million, was split between both authorities, Milton Keynes Council and Central Bedfordshire Council, who contributed up to £3 million. Pounds. Seeing the road open is very satisfying, and it was only through working together that we could overcome the challenges and overcome any problems which did arise during the construction period. But perhaps the biggest obstacle and challenge to the project was constructing the road whilst making sure that this key corridor remained open at all times. It was of great benefit that we had the M1 right next door so we could use that as a key diversion route for traffic, particularly considering some of the distribution centres within the Milton Keynes area. So we have had some good compliments from the, the travelling public on how well the traffic management has been implemented on the scheme. It's nice to get that feedback. People don't realise what hard sweat and tears go into things like this. We've got two bridges that have been constructed, earthworks. So from a civil engineering perspective, it's been, it's been a very good job. We've had five apprentices through the scheme that do placements with us, bringing them into the industry and encouraging them to come into civil engineering. I'm Amy, I've uh, been a Quest student on this project, I did a six week placement. I had a really good time, I got to work with lots of different engineers, I got to see what the actual role is like. So for me working on this project and being able to get hands on experience is really valuable. I've got a deeper understanding of what I'm going to need to do for my role and I think especially such a big project has really helped me get that rounded experience. It's been so satisfying to see it finally opened up and see how many people have been driving up and down it today. The difference between having it just running single lanes and now to have all four lanes open has been really exciting. 